Hey everyone, Siobhan here, Driving for Your Success. And a few weeks ago, I was talking with a friend of mine who had listened to a podcast interview I had done. And uh, he said there was something that really stuck at, struck out for me. And I haven't heard you say this, and I've known you for quite some time. And here's the little treasure that he heard. He heard that when you're sending an energy or a text or when you're communicating into a sales conversation or prospective conversation, uh, let's not bring the energy from the last conversation into it. So what does that mean? It means, can you leave it behind and drop it? Well, in my world, you can. I have some tools and technologies like cutting the cords. You can do a search for those in uh, the Driving for Your Success series or actually here on my channel. Uh, and uh, really clean up your thoughts and your energies before you go into a new conversation. If you're gonna send an email, and we need to send a lot of communicative emails. We're really not very good at it. We need to get much better at our copywriting and communication. But if you're going to send them, make sure you use that cord cutting technique that I was telling you about that is going to get you free from what you were thinking about, free from those older energies that are not going to help move that message forward to your clients or your prospects. So clean up your energy. Leave behind what uh, you were doing before you started writing your email or having a prospective client conversation. This is super important. Uh, if you're going to do a podcast, make sure that you are really there with them and you don't have other stuff, on, stuff up on your screen because what you'll discover is you're going to be distracted and your message is not going to get across clearly and concisely and authentically you're going to just be like an automaton when i had a, a podcast in the ancient days i think it's even somewhere on itunes still um, i used to do a lot of interviews and this one person who i love dearly she has become a very good friend of mine um, would come on to the podcast she would be in her rote communication style you know to get and drive home her message and it didn't matter what questions I asked and so I actually stopped inviting her on because she refused to go off topic and really have a true deep authentic conversation which is what she's all about anyway so uh, when you're getting your message out there make sure to clean up your energy Clean up your energy, clean up your energy before you send it out so people can really hear what you're trying to communicate. My name is SiobhanMoran.com. <laughs> that's not my name, that's my website. See, I just did it. Uh, and uh, you can go to SiobhanMoran.com uh, to get more information. And I am driving for your success. Thanks, have a great day.